Namaste and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I will be doing this look. If you want to see how to achieve this look, please keep on watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you'll be notified of my new videos. Hi guys, welcome to today's video. I'm going to go ahead and start with my face today. For my primer today, I'm going to go ahead and use this Tatcha Silk Canvas. I'm going to take this on my fingers and I'm going to apply it all over my face, starting with my T-zone. Next, I'm going to go ahead and go into the Anastasia Beverly Hill Contour Kit and I'm going to go into the shade Warm Coral. And using a Morphe 173, I'm going to go ahead and color correct under my eyes and around my mouth area. For my foundation today, I'm going to go ahead and use Laura Mercier in the shade Suntan. In my foundation, I'm also going to take this highlighter from Jennifer Lopez and this is in the shade Live in the Highlight. I'm going to take a very tiny bit of it on my palette. Using my finger, I'm going to go ahead and mix the two together. I'm just going to dab it all over my face. And then using a damn beauty blender, I'm gonna blend it out. I'm also gonna take it over my eyes as well, just to even everything out. This is such a good foundation. It gives you such a natural look and it is so full coverage. If you don't want to use this highlighter, you can also use Max Go Light. For my concealer today, I'm going to use this Tarte Shape Tape in the shade Light Medium Honey. And using a damp beauty blender, I'm going to blend all of it out. For contouring, I'm going to go back into the Anastasia Beverly Hill Contour Kit and I'm going to take the shade Chocolate. Using a Lorex contour brush, I'm going to go ahead and contour my cheeks and I'm also going to take some of it on my chin area. I'm also going to take some of it on my forehead as well. I'm going to blend that contour out using the sculpting brush from Real Techniques. Whenever you're blending out your contour on the jawline, you want to bring it down a little bit so it creates that shadow. After blending it with a brush, I'm gonna take my Beauty Blender one more time and blend everything out. For setting under my eyes, I'm gonna use my Fenty Beauty Powder in the shade Banana. I'm just gonna take this on a setting brush from Real Techniques. I'm gonna take this powder over my eyelids as well. For my bronzer today, I'm gonna to go into this Omega Bronzer from Hourglass. There's not really a lot of product on my brush. I'm just taking a little bit of it just to warm up the skin. For my blush today, I'm going to use this Balm Cosmetics blush, and this is in the shade Lace. And I'm going to apply this blush using a Sony Kashuk blush brush. After that, I'm going to grab my Tatcha Dewy Mist, and I'm going to spray it on my Beauty Blender. I'm going to take it all over my face. And as usual, I'm going to go ahead and fill in my eyebrows using this brow pencil from Benefits, and this is in the shade 4. I'm going to go ahead and start with my eyes, and for that I'm going to go into this Huda Beauty Desert Dust Palette. From this palette, I'm going to go into this shade right here called Musk, and using a Morphe 504, I'm going to take this all over my lid. Next, using a Morphe 330, I'm going to go into the shade Oud, and I'm going to take this shade mainly in my crease. Next, taking that same blending brush, Morphe 504, I'm going to go back into musk. I'm just patting this product on my eyelid. And once it's almost nothing on the brush, I'm going to go ahead and blend everything out. I'm just going to take my beauty blender and clean out the edges. 
Then using a small flat brush from Real Techniques, I'm gonna go back into Oud and I'm just gonna smoke out my lower lash line. I'm not taking a lot of product, just a very little bit, just to smoke it out just a tiny bit. Then I'm gonna take my finger and blend it out even further more. After that, I'm gonna take my Fenty Beauty eyeliner. I'm gonna trace my eye shape first, then I'm gonna do the wing at the end. For my mascara today, I'm gonna take this NARS Climax Mascara. I'm going to take this eyeliner from Marc Jacobs in the color black, and I'm going to take this on my upper waterline. For my highlighter today, I'm gonna to go into this Jaclyn Hill palette, and I'm gonna take the shade Champagne Pop. And using a Morphe 501, I'm gonna apply this on top of my cheekbones, and take this on the bridge of my nose as well, and just a very tiny bit of it on my forehead. And why not the chin area? I'm also gonna take this on my brow bone. And using a BH Cosmetics number no. seven brush, I'm gonna take this highlight on the inner corner of my eye. For my lipstick today, I'm gonna to use this Uncensored from Fenty Beauty. To finish it all up, I'm gonna use my Urban Decay All Nighter. And here's the finished look, you guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you'll be notified of my new videos. And I will see you next time. Ciao.